Hi guys, this is Abhishek and you are watching TechSet. Connect with me on Facebook, follow me on Instagram and Twitter and view my blogs on blogspot.com. You can watch my other videos from my playlist to upgrade yourself because in my channel you will get all you need in tech. In this video, we will learn how to install Mac Mojave 10.14 in Windows. I have also created a video how to use Android Oreo in Windows. If you did not see that video, please go and check that and I will give you a link in the description. So this is my YouTube channel. You can also connect with me on Facebook, follow me on Instagram and Twitter and view my blogs on blogspot.com. Now let's discuss how to install Mac in Windows and what are the requirements. Our first requirement is we should have the VirtualBox. Second is VirtualBox extensions. And third is Mac Mojave 10.14 image. Now we are gonna download them one by one. So without wasting any time, let's start. To download official virtual box, I'm gonna open Chrome and don't worry guys, I will give you all the links in the description. From here, we have to download latest virtual box for Windows. Click on download. Once you click on start download, it will start downloading, but I'm gonna cancel it because I have already downloaded it. And second requirement is VirtualBox extensions. For that, scroll down the page and click on all supported platforms and it will start downloading. And third requirement is Mac Mojave 10.14 image. For that, click on download, it will start downloading. I have also downloaded this image, so I'm not gonna download it again. Now, I have some steps for you, just follow them. Step 1, after doing this process, go to your download folder and install VirtualBox exe file. I have already installed VirtualBox, so I'm not gonna repeat that. Step 2, after installing VirtualBox, double click on VirtualBox extension pack and install it. Once you double click on it, it will give you a message, reinstall extension pack because it is already installed. So I'm not gonna reinstall it again. Step 3. Go back to your download folder and click on Compressed. Right click on it. Extract this RAR file by using WinRAR like I'm doing. So it is done. Open this folder and see this image. We are gonna use this image to install Mac in VirtualBox. Step 4. Let's create virtual machine for Mac. For that, open VirtualBox, click on Machine, then click on New. Here type machine name for example i'm using mac mojave 10.14 copy this name click on next here we need to provide ram for this virtual machine by default it is recommended 2 gb but i'm gonna provide it 4 gb because i have 8 gb of ram click on next next page will give you three options first is do not add a virtual disk second is create a virtual disk now Third is use an existing virtual hard disk. We will select third option. Select file icon and select your hard disk image. This is the file I'm gonna use but in your case if it is not showing here then click on add. You will see your extracted file. Just select it and click on open. Now select it again and click on choose then click create. Step 5. This is the time to make some settings in virtual machine. For that, click on Mac, then click on Settings. From here, click on System and you can also see how much RAM you have given to this virtual machine. Now click on Processor and it is selected 1, just make it 2. Then click on Display and make video memory 128MB. Now click on USB and select USB 3.0. Then click OK. We are done with the settings of virtual machine. You can close VirtualBox now. Step 6. This is very important step. Here we will run some commands. Just copy and paste that commands in the command prompt. For that notepad is open and these are the codes and commands which we need to run in command prompt. So open command prompt as an admin and now copy each command and paste on command prompt one by one. I'm gonna make it fast to save our time.
so all the codes has been executed now you can close command prompt and notepad step 7 to install mac mojave simply open virtual box now to start this virtual machine click on start and it will start booting mac operating system you can see it is booting you have to be patient while installing mac because it will take time so we have a apple logo it is loading it is done now select your region i'm just selecting united states you can select any region now select your keyboard and click on continue this is a data privacy just click on continue after click on continue you will get some options for transferring information your first option is from the time machine second is from a windows pc and third is don't transfer as you all know we are installing mac first time so select the third option don't transfer and click on continue this page brings a apple id sign in page if you have one you can type here for my case i'm just gonna click on setup later then click on skip and continue next page will give you terms and condition just click on agree now we have a create computer account page for my case i'm using Texit. you can use any name type the password confirm it again and give a password hint so i'm typing my name abby and click on continue this page will give you options to select a theme for mac if you want to select dark then click on it or if you want to use light then let it be the same and click on continue this is the final step it is setting up your mac now we have introduction page click on continue it is all done let's try to open safari and browse internet so i clicked on safari it is open i'm typing my youtube channel name and that is www.youtube.com forward slash text live and press enter you can watch my whole playlist to gain more knowledge and on the right corner you have some links if you want to get up to date then you can connect with me on facebook instagram twitter or you can also check my blogs question time guys now tell me how much ram i have given to mac operating system and your options are option a 540 megabyte option b 620 gb option c 4 gb you can type your answers in next 10 seconds below the comment section so that's all from my side if you like my videos then hit like make comments share my videos on whatsapp and facebook so that we can spread the knowledge and don't forget to subscribe my channel and hit the bell icon for latest updates thank you